issues Order. that have created so much Mem disorder. Members' time has expired. <coughs> I call uh, Stuart Smith. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Well, it is a pleasure to rise to speak on the Oranga Tamariki uh, Bill. I think it's a fantastic step forward, and it's, it really comes out of the expert panel's report on uh, modernising uh, youth, child, youth, and family, which was released on, in April of last year. And I think uh, some very strong words came from the previous speaker, and, and I uh, admire her passion. Um, I don't agree, but I admire her passion. But that report found uh, quite clearly that the child was not at the centre of the legislation. And that, that was a major part of the uh, discussion. So I wasn't involved in this all the way through. But I, uh, I did uh, sit on the committee for a good part of that uh, consideration. And it was a lot of passionate discussion. And I would like to take an opportunity actually to acknowledge um, the Honourable Hekia Parata, who uh, on that committee made an invaluable con contribution around definitions and so on and the language. And I've really highlighted to me what a, what a, a terrific loss or tremendous loss we're going to have uh, for this part, from this parliament when she uh, leaves after the election. I pay tribute to her because uh, she's been a fantastic member of uh, Minister of Education, as everyone knows, probably you know, one of the best ever. But to uh, see her contribution in other areas, it's just um, my admiration has grown significantly since uh, sitting on that commit committee with her. But, Mr Speaker, one of the earlier speakers uh, said it takes a, a village to raise a child, and I totally agree with that. Um, but we must do that in a way to ensure that when that child comes under state purview that they are in a safe and loving home and environment. Uh, to not do that is to, is to really abdicate the role of the state to uh, give that child a chance at a happy childhood and to be able to grow up through that. They're not going to be um, uh, torn away from their uh, cultural identity. In fact, we spent hours on that very point to ensure that was covered in the legislation and around the words. And it seems uh, you know, legal definitions and things people get, can get quite head up about. But the language has to be clear, and on my uh, belief it is clear in the bill. And this is about keeping children at the centre of, of this legislation and ensuring that they have a fair crack at life and maintain their cultural uh, identity and roots. So, Mr Speaker, it's a, with great uh, pleasure that I commend this bill to the House. Thank you. I call uh, Jen Logie. Thank you, Mr Speaker. Um, it's with a heavy heart that I rise to speak on this bill, um, the Children, Young Persons, Their Families, Oranga Tamariki.